guys and gals, it's crack a lacking Spice here. Welcome to another video on my channel. Man, look, I've been bugging the crap out of my wife for like the last week and a half. <clears throat> About a couple weeks ago, I went in the store, uh, to my local tobacco store, and I asked them, Hey, when do y'all think y'all are going to get Copenhagen Black in? They're like, well, we don't know. Well, as a matter of fact, the same day, uh, the rep for Copenhagen for our area was coming through the door. So I asked him, I said, hey man, when do you think Copenhagen Black is going to come on our shelves? He said, about two weeks. Well, that, that was about two weeks ago. So j he said about two weeks. So for the last week and a half, I've been taking my wife, getting her to drive me from from here to a 50 mile radius, going to every store, every tobacco store, trying to see if they got Copenhagen Black in yet. And also uh, Grizzly uh, Premium Dark, but that'll be another video. Today, Copenhagen Black. Started off this morning, you know, 30 miles down the road, Went to them stores and just worked my way back. Finally got to a tobacco store that had Copenhagen Black. Man, I am so excited. So I got three of them cans. Ah, what we're going to do, we're going to crack this seal. And I'm going to see what this is all about. This is fire. It's, 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 it's age three years in a barrel. Uh, you know, over hardwood, it's it's fire it's fire heated over uh, with hard American hardwood. Uh, it says it dates back to Wayman himself. Uh, this is Wayman's uh, reserve, um, limited time only that they're gonna have this. They didn't do a whole bunch. Uh, they just done, or they say they only done a small batch. Uh, but they have the Copenhagen Black now. About a year ago. They had it to where you voted for Copenhagen Black. I think Copenhagen, um, the wintergreen uh, aged tobacco, and I think the mint aged. But uh, obviously the Copenhagen Black overruled. And we're going to crack the seal, and we're going to see what it's all about. Give me one second. I'm going to crack the seal open. Alrighty, got that seal broke. Kind of Kind of hard to do with a broken wing here. So got that seal broken. Oh wow! Oh, it's kind of—it's kind of got a a little bit of a sweet smell, uh, kind of a hickory honey smell. Oh, let's crack it open. Hold on, I'm trying to open up a can with one hand. Look at that, man! Oh man, I kind of got a, a hint of the uh, Copenhagen whiskey bourbon, you know. Kind of got a kind of got a whiskey smell to it. Oh man, let's pack a lip, guys and gals. Oh yeah. Hmm. Oh. Oh man, gotta get a little little pinch in there. Oh man, let that let that salviate sal salviate or whatever you call it. Let that let that uh, kind of marinate in the mouth for a second. Copenhagen is um, one hundred percent American tobacco. Oh man. Try to think. Mm. Okay, you get a, you do get a whiskey kind of a whiskey hit to it, but you know it's 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 aged. I think you know I do believe it's aged in a whiskey barrel type deal. Um, you know, I was I was you know thinking that it was going to be kind of a a straight or a natural taste, but oh man, this has a taste all to itself. Oh, that has got to be one of the best dips I've ever put in my mouth. 
and I'm and I'm a strong, you know, str uh, wintergreen guy. Uh, Copenhagen wintergreen, Timberwolf wintergreen, Grizzly wintergreen. That those are my pretty much everyday dips. I don't really stray far from it unless I'm wanting to try another tobacco uh, flavor. But man, if they, I, I'm definitely going and buying a couple rolls of these, sticking them in my freezer. Oh my god. I can't put my tongue on it. Like I said, all I can taste is, you know, it's kind of got that whiskey taste to it, that whiskey hit to it. Kind of like a, a, it's got a little bit of smoky taste. Like hickory. Oh, oh my God. That, guys and gals, if you dip and you want a good flavor, tobacco, Copenhagen, black, Wayman's Reserve. Oh my god. This is uh this is classic long cut. Um and man, it is it is delicious. Whew, I'm so glad I was able to find that can or you know find it so soon. Nobody else in in, in like I said in a fifty mile radius had this can and I got my hands on one. Up uh, three as a matter of fact. I'm so glad I did. This is this is outrageous. Oh, guys, you hear it from me on my channel, Copenhagen Wintergreen, uh, Copenhagen Black, not 10 for 10, 11 for 10, 15 for 10. Go get it, try it out for yourself, do a video, let me know what you think, you know, come back and leave in the comment section below, hey, uh, Spicy, I tried this out, man, it's excellent. Whoo, man, Copenhagen Black, guys, got it. Hope you can get it soon. All right. Thank you all for watching. This is my little uh, review on the Copenhagen Black. I will talk to you all guys and gals later. Remember, everybody's got a little backwoods in them. I'll catch you later.